Having been a Greyhawk in this type of atmosphere environment, wasting your time, does that mm -hmm. help at all, or does 2019 maybe not play into it? No, for sure. Uh, I think, I mean, Tommy and I kind of know what to expect. Uh, I mean, that, probably the only time I play 100 wet or degree uh, type of course, so just, that's obviously a little different. Uh, but like we know what to expect. I mean, yeah. we know it's going to be playing short. Uh, it's going to be flying far. Things are going to be firm. Uh, but yeah, it's nice that we, we get the chance to play two years ago. I mean, so even if they, you know, the golf is different playing when it's 100, do you have to like uh, but playing I, differently or how do you... Not really. I mean, I just have like a cold top, a wet towel around my head uh, when I walk. Uh, and it's probably the only time of the year when I'm happy to have a 6 a.m. tea time. So it's going to be one day. I mean, waking up at 3.30 is not easy, but when you know it's going to be 75 instead of 100, it's kind of nice. So. Having that experience of getting to match play, does you need to have that in your back pocket? It's you guys' goal is to get back there again this time. Yeah, for sure. Uh, I mean, I play a lot of match play. I love it because, uh, you know, anyone can beat anyone on a given day. That's what's fun about match play. Uh, I mean, yeah. The, the goal is to make top eight, and then from there, just go as far as we can and hopefully get a, a title. Did you learn something about playing match play at that kind of level last time you guys were here at top eight, uh, getting to go against yeah. one of the other best teams in the country? I mean, it was fun, but we, we lost. I uh, only got to play one match play, and the guy I played against that year uh, got subbed in for, for match play, and they already know the course very well, so he gave me a little easier on me. But, um, I mean, playing you know, for your teammates, for your coach, and against some of the best players in the country is always fun. What's what he's maybe brought to this program, even just in you know, about a year? Yeah, uh, I mean, he, he's been very consistent. Uh, he likes winning, uh, which is great when you're part of this program. Uh, and he loves to compete. You know, he's every day, he, he's true grinding, play against anyone he can in any part of his game. Probably the only guy I know who has someone I was doing playing contest, shorting contest, anything. So he, he's been very competitive and he's been very good to us. As when the opportunity for him to transfer sort of developed, you know, what did what, what you think at the time? And kind of, did you talk with him a lot about that? Or? Yeah, I talked a little bit with him. Uh, I mean, the coaches kind of asked me about him because I got to play uh, a lot the last two, three years with him uh, over in Belgium. Uh, and, and his game has improved a lot. And, and last year, we were struggling a little bit with death. And I thought that he could be a, a, a good key to our team. Yeah, so college golf is different in that I mean, it's an individual sport but with this team aspect. What, what's he brought? Maybe just beyond being able to get some scores. Yeah. The team kind of kind of I mean, like I said, he, he, he's a winner. Um, he loves competing, and that, that that's big when you're part of a team, you know, pushing each other to be better. And that's something that he's done very well this year. Yeah, unless Coach has got another Belgian in his back pocket, you and Matisse are going to kind of be the last of this line. It's been uh, like for a decade. Just what do you kind of think about you know, what maybe Thomas Peter started and has, has gone through? Yeah. 10 plus years at this point. No, I mean, it's very cool. Um, I mean, if it wasn't for Thomas Peters, I probably wouldn't be here today, probably somewhere else. So I I'm very thankful that he decided to go with Coach Bull. I mean, he was the first guy from Belgium, maybe first uh, guy from Europe to come here. Um, it was never easy when you're the first one. And yeah, I'm just very thankful for him, for, for him to, to have done that. Anything else for Adrian?